I think uh, Tour of Flanders is one of the highlights uh, in the season and uh, yeah, we're always uh, looking forward to that. Uh, we showed that we were in a good shape, it was a little bit uh, less the last uh, races, but uh, yeah, we are definitely ready for, uh, for the Tour of Flanders. Well, I think if you have a team like this, it's difficult to say you have one leader. I think we have three or four girls that can be in the top uh, finishing and yeah, we uh, start with a pretty open strategy. So we have uh, three riders who uh, can be on the podium. Anna is in a very good shape. Uh, Amy was last year on the podium. Chantal wins it uh, last year. And then we have Demi following the new rider what is in the team. And uh, yeah, I also expect her uh, very high in the end. We saw also that uh, last week Chantal Blaak and uh, Jolien Dore were a little bit sick. Are they now still in a good uh, condition? Well, it's always the question mark uh, how sick were they uh, and, and how good are they recovered from that. And that can go two sides. Uh, I mean, I think it can be really good or they're just good and not good enough to make the difference. And uh, I think a, a good Chantal can, can win. But yeah, we need to see Sunday if she's recovered enough from, uh, from the sickness. Anna and Demi are coming back from an altitude stage on Sierra Nevada. Is this race not a little bit too early for them? No, I think we, we are fine with that. And uh, normally it's uh, seven, eight days, and yeah, we are exactly in that uh, period. So we think that uh, that it should be good. What kind of race do you expect? Well, I hope. Let, let us say I hope we have a very hard race, and uh, everybody starts racing from the beginning. That should be uh, nice for us and yeah, what I said, I think uh, our team is also uh, a big group from the favourites and uh, we are ready for it.